Okay, so now we're going to reinstall the bearing. You're going to take your bearing, drop it onto the hub shell here, just get it set in there kind of straight. You're going to, using the Novatec installer, you're going to drop that over the bearing. Then you're going to use the 1524 tool right here from the press kit, the T handle with the long threaded rod. You're going to take this, tube drops in through here. The uh, short piece just goes over the top of that. Either way, it doesn't matter. Take, make sure that your center tube is coming all the way through the bearing on the, and take your T-handle with the threaded rod, put it through, pop it in, set it down so it's holding it up like that. Take, your, take the other longer tail piece, put the 28 side down, the larger side down onto the bearing. Put your threaded rod on it, make sure it drops into the slot. So now the whole thing is put like this. Keeping it this way so that that center tube stays down to the bearing side. Put the bearing side down, start tightening up the T-handles. Uh, you might, what you might have to do is you might have to take a hammer and just, if you see one side of the bearing is up a little, Tap a little bit on that side just to keeven it up. And then continue tightening it. And just kind of work with it as you go through. Checking the bearing. There you go. Bearing back in the hub. So that it's nice and smooth. At this point, you're going to want to make sure you take your, your crush sleeve. If there's any shims with it, make sure that they go in. Drop that over the bearing on the far side. Take your free hub with the seal installed onto the free hub. And you're going to work it in, just push it down in. Put the free hub in so the falls engage the ratchet ring past the bearing. Drop the axle in to line up the crush leaves once it's in, all the way through the bearing. Ratchet ring's in. Just go through with your finger and push the seal down into the hub shell so it should turn freely. Take your end cap, thread your end cap back on, get your cone wrenches, snug that up. Doesn't have to be real tight, it's just snug. And there it is.